JBTV will take you through the life of Henrietta Lacks, who was born in 1920 in rural Virginia. Life as an African-American woman in the segregated South was challenging. I married David Lacks, and we built a life together. We raised our five children in Turner Station, a bustling community near Baltimore. Known for my vibrant spirit and unwavering love for my family, I worked tirelessly on the tobacco farms that had sustained generations of my family. In 1951, at the young age of 30, I discovered a lump on my cervix. This discovery would forever alter the course of my life and the future of medicine. I sought treatment at Johns Hopkins Hospital, the only hospital in the area that treated African-American patients. I placed my trust in the doctors, unaware that my cells would soon become instrumental in a scientific revolution. The cells taken from Henrietta's body possessed an extraordinary characteristic. They could survive and replicate outside the human body, something no human cells had ever done before. Henrietta's cells, dubbed Hela after the first two letters of her first and last names, became the first immortal human cell line. I, Dr. George Gay, had been attempting to grow human cells in culture and recognized the momentous discovery. Hela cells, unlike any other cells I had encountered, multiplied rapidly and indefinitely, defying the limitations of normal cells. This breakthrough opened up unprecedented avenues for scientific exploration. The scientific community quickly grasped the significance of Hela cells. For the first time, researchers had access to a virtually limitless supply of human cells that could be used to study a wide range of diseases and develop new treatments. Hela cells were shipped to laboratories around the world, becoming an indispensable tool in medical research. Hela cells proved instrumental in the development and testing of the polio vaccine, saving countless lives and transforming the trajectory of public health. This marked the beginning of a new era in medicine, with Hela cells at the forefront of groundbreaking discoveries. Hela cells have played a pivotal role in countless scientific breakthroughs over the past seven decades. Their ability to grow and replicate indefinitely has made them an invaluable tool for studying a vast array of diseases, including cancer, HIV, AIDS, and Parkinson's disease. Researchers have used HeLa cells to develop new drugs and therapies, test the safety of vaccines, and understand the fundamental mechanisms of human biology. They have been instrumental in developing in vitro fertilization techniques, bringing the joy of parenthood to countless couples struggling with infertility. HeLa cells have even been sent into space to study the effects of microgravity on human cells, expanding the frontiers of scientific knowledge beyond the confines of our planet. The contributions of HeLa cells to medical science are immeasurable. Section 4, Ethical Crossroads, the lack of consent and its implications. The groundbreaking discoveries facilitated by HeLa cells came at a cost. Henrietta Lacks was never informed that her cells had been taken or that they had become an invaluable scientific resource. Her family remained unaware of the existence of HeLa cells for decades, even as these cells were being bought, sold, and used in research around the world. The lack of informed consent in Henrietta's case raised profound ethical questions about patient autonomy, bodily integrity, and the commercialization of human tissue. It ignited a debate about the ownership of genetic material and the rights of individuals to control the use of their cells and tissues for research purposes. Section 5, The Lax Family, A Story of Loss, Resilience and Advocacy. The revelation of HeLa cells' existence and their profound impact on medicine came as a shock to the Lax family. We grappled with the complex emotions of pride, anger and grief, coming to terms with the legacy of our mother and her unwitting contribution to science. Our journey has been marked by pain, resilience and a determination to reclaim our narrative. The Lax family has faced numerous challenges in the wake of Hella Cell's fame. Despite these hardships, we have shown remarkable strength and resilience. In recent years, we've become increasingly vocal in advocating for greater recognition of Henrietta Lax's contributions to science and for more control over the use of her cells. Section 6. Henrietta Lax's Enduring Legacy, a Catalyst for Change. Henrietta Lacks's story is a powerful reminder that behind every scientific breakthrough lies a human story. Her cells, 
taken without her knowledge or consent, have left an indelible mark on the world, transforming the landscape of medical research and saving countless lives. The story of Hella Cells has sparked a global conversation about the importance of informed consent, patient autonomy, and the responsible use of human tissue in research. It has led to the implementation of stricter regulations and ethical guidelines to protect the rights of patients and ensure that such an egregious violation of consent never happens again. Her legacy is a testament to the power of one person's cells to impact the world and a call to action to ensure that scientific progress is achieved ethically and equitably. Like and subscribe. Hit the bell notification for more amazing stories from JBTV. Remember, it's not just TV, it's just better TV. Thank you for watching Just Better TV. If you enjoyed our content, please like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell to stay updated on our latest motivational videos, fun facts, and inspirational stories. See you soon.